this story I'm about to tell y'all should encourage some of y'all to get off your lazy asses when you're sitting home feeling sorry for yourself and do something with your fucking life. The story's about Lizzie Velasquez, okay? She was voted the ugliest woman in the world in an eight second video that was actually posted on YouTube. People told her to kill herself, called her a it, called her a monster. You got what I'm saying? This woman actually has a disease. She has an affliction, has a you know physical issue. It's so rare that as a matter of fact, only two other people in the world are thought to have it. She's actually 0% body fat, that don't make no sense, right? All of us in the fitness community, from what we studied, said you're supposed to be dead at 0% body fat. But apparently, she has 0% body fat, and she only weighs 60 pounds. She's unable to, like, create a lot of muscle, fat, you know, uh, energy. So, you know, I guess she's a, a, a modern miracle and marvel. But the whole thing is this. After being discouraged with that, being called the ugliest woman in the world, people telling her to kill herself and being called all types of names. All those stares, she actually made goals for herself after all that shit, okay? She said she wanted to graduate college, all right? She wanted to have a family, okay? She wanted to write a book, she wanted to get her degree, and uh, she wanted to become a motivational speaker. And guess what, she's already been booked for 200 speaking events and she's already got her book out, okay? Now, for those of y'all that sit home, it's like, oh, I'm too fat, or oh, I'm, I'm this, I'm, I'm ugly. <laughs> Shit, take a look at her picture. And this isn't cracking on her. I realize this woman has a, is an issue. For all of you out there that sit home and say, oh, I'm ugly, and I'm this, and I'm that, take a look at her picture and look at the mountains that she's climbed, all right? She's already getting through college, got her book out, and she's on her way to achieving like half of her goals. Okay, she was a teenager then, she's 23 now. You know what I'm saying? So, my hat is off to you, Lizzie. I'm serious, you are doing good and you keep doing it. Cause you, 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 you got much more to, you know, you got a lot of ways to go. Having already at 23 done that. There's people at 63 that haven't done what you've done. They ain't got no damn degree and they ain't got a book out. They're just sitting home doing nothing. So, um, like I said, my hat's off to you and uh, keep doing what you're doing.